from the News Channel 5 Network. I'm Amy Watson with your morning headlines. Glad to have you with us. Seven cases of the coronavirus now confirmed in Tennessee. There are four confirmed cases in Williamson County and one each in Davidson, Shelby and Sullivan counties. Williamson County schools are closed again today along with Dixon County schools as a family member of a student is being tested for the virus. The state announced yesterday that all of Tennessee's major medical insurance carriers will cover the cost of coronavirus testing. And the body of a missing boater has been found along the Tennessee River. The person's body was found yesterday near Shiloh National Military Park. It has been sent to the medical examiner's office in Memphis for identification, but officials believe it is one of the three people who went missing after a fishing competition last month near the Pickwick Dam. Today, officials in Putnam County will get an estimation on what it will cost to remove all the tornado debris. Just yesterday, the National Guard arrived in the county, bringing in large trucks and equipment to clear right of ways. Thousands of you have helped raise almost $600,000 to help victims in Putnam County. If you still want to help, you can find links to do that at newschannel5.com. All right, let's check our forecast. Here's Leland. Around the Mid-South for us today, we'll start with a mostly cloudy sky. Some hits of sunshine for us this morning. About a 30-40% rain chance this afternoon, especially in the west-southwestern areas. At chances lower as you get to Nashville and to the east. Overnight tonight, the rain chances pick up. Area showers tomorrow. We'll keep an eye on tomorrow and tomorrow afternoon. A couple of the storms could be on the strong to severe side, so something we'll watch carefully. Wind, hail, key concerns, but isolated tornadoes cannot be ruled out as we head into Thursday. And then for the weekend, still more rain chances off and on through the weekend and into next week. I'm meteorologist Leland Statham. Enjoy your Wednesday.